Hey, it's Yasmin here at Beale Street Music Festival with Big Boy. Yes. Looking just comfortable. It's all get out, okay? Man, yeah, I just uh, took a bath with some baby wipes. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like a baby. Where my blanket at? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, Big, you, you've performed at many uh, music festivals all over the world. Um, well, how does the Beale Street, 37 years now this, this festival has been happening, how so, does it differ from other festivals? Um, we performed on the Mississippi River. Yeah. So the, there in itself is like, you know, a history in that, you mm -hmm. know. Um, the crowd was amazing, you know. Um, they call us the festival killers, and right. it's just another notch on the belt. And it, it felt really good. The crowd was very receptive, and we had a good time. Let's talk about the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Uh, Public Enemy recently got inducted. Yes, yeah. Tell me what, how you feel about that, and, and I mean, are you excited, maybe anxious for Outkast yeah. one day to get inducted? Oh, definitely, man. I mean, for one, Public Enemy definitely deserve it, along with uh, the BC Boys who are already in there, and mm -hmm. also Run DMC. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, I mean, shit, everybody knows Outkast is up next, future Hall of Famers, That's you right. know what I'm saying? But it's dope, man. Chuck D, Flavor Flay, Professor Griff, the S1Ws, Terminator X, I mean, just, you know, all really played a part in the mold and the artist I am today. So it's congratulations and just, just blessings to them and their families for right now, yeah. Yeah, now, um, I, besides the music, I always love the visuals that, that you all put out. Yeah. Okay, now, yeah. what, do you have a favorite Outcast <laughs> or, yeah. or even Big Boy, even Andre yeah. music video? Uh, I gotta say, Bonzo Bad Dad is like my all time favorite. I love that video. Too. That's like my all time yes. favorite, man. It was like 130 degrees Fahrenheit <laughs> in Atlanta when we shot it. You know, we changed clothes about 10 times. You know, we always like to, you know, kind of express ourselves through the, the, the outfits and stuff like that. So we got a chance to change clothes and mm -hmm. we had a good time. It was hot. Had a lot of beautiful girls in the video and, yeah. and the energy just from the song itself, you know, played a major part in, in the visual. So yeah, yeah. definitely Bonzo Bad Dad. Now, Vicious Lies and Dangerous Rumors. Um, we be releasing any other uh, singles yeah, from that? Yeah, definitely, definitely. I'm going to try to release a song, a uh, single for every song. The next one up, okay. we just shot the video for uh, Tom Petty uh, featuring my comrade, Killer Mike. All right. Um, it's just, you know, it's like a tour video, live video, <laughs> you know, just capturing the essence of the first two weeks of the tour. Mm -hmm. It is dope. I mean, we actually was looking at the the rough cut just before y'all walked on the bus, so mm -hmm. it looks real good, man. So look forward in the next uh, week or two, so def definitely. I was going to ask about Killer Mike later, but let's ask about him now. Yeah. I mean, it's so funny. You got, you got your Gossa name, and he and he's like right in my eye line. <laughs> yeah. Okay? Now, you have a name like Killer Mike, which yeah. might, might scare the bejesus out of some people, yeah. but... This man is a teddy bear. Come on now. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah I yeah. mean, what's what's tell me what it's like working with this man. Uh, it's it's dope, man. It's it's, it's, it's truly dope. You know, um, uh, artists that you know that we we really choose to work with. We handpick them. Killer Mike was one of the ones I handpicked along with Janelle Monae. Yes. And now we have uh, Fish Hawk as a new group. But it's just like artists I believe in that you know can bring something to the craft. And I mean, he's never let me down. Definitely. Yeah. Um, got the album out, rap music, and we're working on the records right now. He got a new album coming out with LP called Run the Jewels, which I'm featured on. Okay. So Song called Banana Clipper, so we're just keeping the whole thing going. All right, all right. Now I was I was extra tight because I heard y'all perform the whole world. Oh yeah, and I man. didn't see it. Oh yeah. My heart hurt. Oh my heart. <laughs> my heart. <laughs> all right. So um, are, are you working on any besides you know working with uh, Killer Mike and the new group that you were just talking about? Are you working on any new material? Um, always. You know, like when we're on tour now, we we stay recording. You know, we um just like maybe 15 days into the tour, and me and Killer Mike got a project we're working on. Okay. Um. As well as a, a lot more surprises, like up and I'm really kind of much booked until the end of 2014, so it's a lot of surprises coming, so y'all gotta stay tuned, man. All right, all right. Yeah. Um, I know for sure you've heard of uh, Chris Kelly, the passing of, you know, yeah, definitely, one man. half of Criss Cross. Any, any thoughts on those, um, that brother right definitely, there? Definitely, man. Like, he's, you know, one of the, 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 the pioneers of Atlanta music. If it wasn't for Criss Cross and the rest of development, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I mean, uh, how could you know about an outcast? You know what I'm saying? So definitely my, my thoughts and prayers go out to his family as well. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. For sure. And the mu not just the music, but also the fashion, because, you know, everybody knows outcasts are their fashion, but yeah. Criss Cross was also yeah, definitely, <laughs> with man. the backwards joints yeah, too. Yeah, yeah, everybody peeing in the ass part of their pants. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> for sure. So, you know, that's, that's real. Yeah. yeah. Um, I know you're so proud of Janelle because she's finally getting yeah. the recognition that yeah. she deserves. Definitely, man. Um, but who else, you know, uh, recognizable names that, that you might be loving to collaborate with this year? Well, I'm definitely a, a big fan of Mumford & Sons. Okay. I'm all day long. Definitely uh, Kate Bush. Um, so, I mean, who knows, man? I mean, I'm, I'm willing to work with uh, anybody got something to bring to the table, but I mean, definitely, that's just off the top of my head. Mumford & Sons, I love them. New, new album, Babel is dope as hell. What do you love about I mean, Mumford just the soul and the, the spirit of the music, you know what I'm saying? I mean, it's like every song is a hold down, like a slow, how can you have a hold, a hold down on a slow song? You know what I'm talking about? 
<laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, it was a pleasure always catching up with you. I'm, I'm digging your, your Ralph Lauren Appreciate polo it. joints. Hey, hey, I'm comfortable. We're waiting on this Mayweather fight, man. Trying to see oh, Guerrero right. go right. put hands on this boy. Okay. Yeah, 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 for sure. <laughs>